Usually they're not this close to the road, but uh, today they are, so I thought I'd take a picture, get a little video. Beautiful day. You gotta get on down the road though. That one's got almost no ears. <laughs> no, no, that one's got ears. There's one looks just like that in the face. Ears are bit off. Hey, bike rider. Wow, you got a good headlight, man. Well, hey everybody, today's video is going to be short and sweet and right to the point. This is lap six. I have got to get back to Ozark. It ain't been easy, but I got it done. Well, I got to get back, but then I got it done. But that's one of the reasons it's going to be short is because it's... This is took a, took a whack out of me, so I don't feel, I don't feel like uh, doing a whole bunch of fancy editing or anything like that. But uh, this would be a back to back 107. I don't know what I'm gonna do tomorrow. I ain't got a clue. I may take the whole day off. I may not. I won't know until I get there. I left out, it was about 3.30. And uh, I literally did something. Well, <laughs> the light that I got synced up with my, my Garmin Phoenix and my watch. And uh, I could have, I could have not accepted it, but I, I did. I accepted it, and then I couldn't make the car the the light go back on a lower, you know, because it's got three settings: super bright, bright, and then less bright. And so it was stuck on super bright because it was going through my watch and it was giving it what it you know, what it thought it needed. It wouldn't allow me to control it. So, um, I rode like that for a pretty good ways, and then I realized it was running the battery down, that it might not have been fully charged. This is like the first time I've really ever charged it up after running it a whole day. So, uh, I said, well, heck, I might as well see if I can do it. I cut the light off, let my eyes, I mean, I, I didn't stop riding. I cut the light off, it's pitch black, no moon, hardly no stars, 
and I let the uh, I let my eyes get adjusted to the darkness and then I noticed I could see the uh, lines the center line and the in the line on the edge of the road better and better and uh, so I, I literally rode without lights for a couple of laps until the sun started coming up and of course it got brighter and brighter but uh, it is amazing at how much light it is 30 minutes before the sun comes up it's pretty darn, darn amazing so I proved to myself and I'll say this I had dreams and I it's been like a recurring dream where I'm riding a bicycle and I'm doing it at night and I'm literally undercover like passing maybe roadblocks or something where nobody can see me I'm you know I'm like and one or two of those dreams those reoccurring dreams I'm literally using night goggles night vision you know gargle really nice pair looking thing on my face where I can see it totally dark but I want to tell you something I can see in the dark damn good evidently uh, I'm not saying it slowed me down I mean I couldn't go my top top speed but uh, I'll try it again later and see what I can do but man the human body is is uh, amazing at what it can do if I wake up in the morning and I really you know back to the feeling if I feel that I can stretch it out and, and possibly do another 107 tomorrow I'll let my body tell me but I'm not gonna push it because uh, I hit a wall today again you know it happens every so often but uh i don't know i guess it's about the 60 mile mark nothing came easy i made it here that that was the hard part because there was a lot of uh opportunity to cut it short but it wasn't gonna happen i wasn't worried about the time so it's gonna be a slow mile per hour average but that's all right i made it and that's why the video is going to be short today <laughs> no fancy editing or nothing you know maybe no music i don't know we'll see but i've got to let this body rest i gotta to go to bed early and get some good sleep tonight just on the umption that i may ride tomorrow but if i don't feel it I'm taking tomorrow off and do a recovery day. All right, people. You know what the hand means. It's time to go. All right, bye-bye.